making his way to the ring from wherever he wants, weighing in at 195 pounds, the Prince. Plenty of drama surrounding this battle royal here tonight. And with so many top names competing in this battle royal, there's no telling who will walk away as the last superstar standing. And the good news is that he appears to be coming into tonight with a little extra motivation. Yeah, he's really had a chip. Battle Royal. I've learned never to pick a favorite in a match like this. I mean, we once saw the Brooklyn Brawler win a Battle Royal, which tells me anything can truly happen here in WWE. surprised by the intensity level inside this arena right now. Not in the least bit, Michael. This is the one the WWE Universe has been looking forward to for quite some time. Some are saying he's in the best shape of his career right now. Would you agree with that, Corey? It's hard not to agree with that statement, Cole. I mean, just look at him. I'll tell you, he's going to be tough to beat, that's for sure. From wherever he wants, weighing in at 159 pounds, Joe Kirk. Here we go, and it sounds to me like the crowd is more than ready for this one. So am I, Michael. I've been looking forward to this match for a long, long time. And I'd also like to add that this match will go a long way in determining the pecking order here in WWE. Yeah, and he's hoping his stock continues to rise. A loss here, though, would certainly crush those hopes. From Venice Beach, California, weighing in at 174 pounds, the Brian Kendrick. Listen to this crowd, guys. They're fired up for this one, as well as they should be. This match has... And there's bodies everywhere as we get this battle royal started. If it was me, I'd start this thing by going right after the biggest competitor then worry about the rest of the field. And let's not forget, we're coming to you live from the hometown of one of the greatest of all time, Shawn Michaels. He gets him with a roundhouse kick, take it down with a beautiful suplex, see what kind of response we'll get. Pure power on 
display right there. Let's talk about Tyson Kidd for a moment. In your expert opinion, what can the WWE Universe expect to see from him? I'm not so sure you can single out one name in this one, Cole. All of these competitors have an opportunity to make an impact here tonight. Look, he needs to stay far out of the way of things for as long as he can. The longer he can conserve his energy, the better. That was brutal. Surprises him with the Enziguri. And now he goes for it a second time. He's looking to cripple him with that backbreaker. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. With the point of the elbow. Just making his presence felt there. Hits the headbutt. He's starting to show signs of fatigue. To be expected when you combine six of WWE's most volatile forces into one match. The good news for him is that everybody gets at least a little beat up in a battle royal. That's just the nature of the beast. He's simply reminding him that he's here. Whoops, not even close. What was he thinking? He's starting to stumble here, but not for a second do I expect him to back down now. Yeah, but if you count him out now, guys, you'd be making a very big mistake. Mark my words. He delivers a hard clothesline. Saw that one coming. He's struggling a bit here. He needs to find a way to get on the offensive, guys. He was one of my favorites heading into this battle royal, and I'm not ready to write him off the list just yet. He's got plenty of fight left in him. He's delivering an old-fashioned butt-kicking right here. Kirk's starting to slow a bit. He's really going to need to create some space for himself. This is certainly true. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. That one was off the mark. Awful. Just plain awful. He hits him with a nasty chop. No, there's the reversal. No, he reverses it. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. When this guy's on, look out. There's the European uppercut. A brutal shot with the forearm. We've seen this before. Nice job. And there it is. That has got to be it. Missed by a large margin on that one. Wow. He's better than that. Neutralizes him with an elbow. He's showing absolutely no pity now, guys. Tyson Kidd gives these fans all they could want and more. We're witnessing a level of punishment that can only be described as severe. Incoming. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. by Tyson Kidd. Tyson Kidd showing us how to get it done. He might just be out, guys. I agree. He hasn't moved one bit. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's going to get a lot tougher. This one's getting ugly. You might want to turn away if you have a weak heart. This is exactly how he drew this one up. Taking quite a beating here. There may be no coming back from this. It looks to me like he's about to find himself on the arena floor, which is a little surprising to me. 
I think a lot of people looked at him as one of the favorites to win this thing. Guys, you can tell he's drained, but I guarantee you that won't stop him from doing everything he can to win this thing. Boom! Samoan driver. Game, set, match. This one is over. And once again, we see a return to the specific maneuver. The match is over. That's all she wrote. Here is your winner, Grand Metalik. Wow, what an amazing performance we saw here in this elimination match. I can assure you, Michael, that that match was just as tough mentally as it was physically. Well, that was indeed a great match, and I think it's worth emphasizing how huge this victory is.